Free Tank Adventure. Um, I told you I'll make a brine shrimp video, and here it is. Some things you'll need is brine shrimp eggs. You can order those online. Some airline tubing, some rigid airline tubing. Some water, and then a 1 liter cup, or like a 1.25 liter cup. You can cut to the bottom off of it, and then tape it down here with some electrical tape. I had this because I had the airline tubing hooked up here. And then I got an air pump. Any cheap thing will work. This is one from my protein scaper that I upgraded. I got a teaspoon and some salt down there. Um, another, you're going to have to put the water in. I got one liter of water. That's good enough. Then you're going to go and take one teaspoon of salt, which I'll show you guys. Got a little bit more. Level it out and put it in there. Then what you're going to want to do, drop that back in your salt thing. You're going to take your airline tubing, assuming you haven't already hooked up to your rigid airline tubing, stick it on your pump. This is a little, that's cool. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to set it inside like that, to where it's always moving. Then you want to take one teaspoon of brine shrimp eggs. I got these, these are like 7% hatch rate, something like that. Well, this is a half teaspoon. You want to pour it in there and just let it go. Then what you want to do is you're going to want to stir it up a little bit so whatever one's kind of then it. Um, get hydrated again in the sink. Get hydrated. Take your airline tubing, stir it up, and put it back down here. Then in about 18 to 36 hours, depending on the temperature of your water, they should hatch. And I'll make another video. And here's a quick tour of my tank. I'm going to feed my fish a little bit. Hold on. I'll do this all on top of my tank. And you guys can see they're all doing great. I'm probably going to get some corals in. I need some subscribers, please. He right out of my hand. He just nailed that. But all my fish are doing great with tangs. I had a dirty comment left about my tangs. I think they'll be fine. As long as you keep all your parameters good, you should be okay. My first coral is probably going to be some pulsing Vino. Because I still want to upgrade my tank. And so in 18 hours, I'm going to have another video coming to you guys. Thank you very much.